Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we are going to construct a 3D model of furniture cabinet in Autodesk and Enter software. So let's get started with today's tutorial. Go to new, take a standard part in millimeter and go to create. Now select the 2D sketch and click on the exit plane. This will be the top view, rotate, here you can see the top view. Now go to line command and here make a rough sketch first till here and a scale. Okay. Make it a center line over here. Okay. Select this line, make it construction and go to dimension. The dimension from this line will be 400 mm. And this vertical height will be of 700 mm. Okay. Now go to horizontal constraint. Click on the center point and click on this bottom. Okay. Now go to mirror. Select both these lines. Go to mirror line and select this center line. Apply and done. Okay. Now we want a thickness. So for thickness, go to offset. Select this complete profile and drag inside and give a dimension of 30 mm. Okay. Now go to line, join the profile. Similarly, join here and escape. Now go to finish sketch and zoom out. Go to extrude command here. Give the total height of 900 mm. So, this is a one directional extrude, but we want it from mid plane, so we will select this symmetric extrude and OK. OK. <coughs> now, we will make the shelf. So, for shelf, select this back face, create sketch. Now, go to rectangle command and we will take the two point rectangle. Select make a rectangle over here and one rectangle over here and for mid we have a midpoint so from here we will select two point center rectangle. Select this midpoint, drag till this end, ok and escape. Now go to dimension, from top this will be at a distance of 80 mm and the width of this will be 30 mm. Okay. Now here the width will be 30 mm and from bottom at 80 mm. Okay. Now the mid one, the width of 30 mm. Okay. And escape. So these are the three shelves. Now finish sketch. Select this inner profile, this bottom and rotate this profile ok so these are the shell profiles here give the dimension as 650 and here we will select join and ok ok so these are the shell now select this corner edge go to fillet here take a fillet radius of 100 mm 100 mm here and this bottom, this edge, zoom out and this edge, ok and ok, ok. So this is the base. Now we will make the drawer profile. So select this front face, go to create sketch and here go to the project geometry you can take, go to project geometry select this face and select this face <coughs> this also go to offset command select this profile drag inside and take offset of 2m similarly select this drag inside offset of 2mm and escape now go to 3d model take x2 select this inner profile 
and select this number of file. Now go to a dimension of 30 mm and flip the direction inside. Okay, so it will be inside. 2 mm difference we have given for to do not make a tight fit, a slight gap should be there. Okay. And here we will take new solid and ok. So this will be complete new solid and this will be different. So here you can see solid 1 is the cabinet and solid 2 are the drawers. Ok. From here you can select. You can see here two number of solids are present. <coughs> now we will make the handles. So select this, go to create sketch. Go to circle command and here make a circle of dia 20 mm. Go to dimensions from side edge. This dimension here will be of 100 mm and the vertical dimension from bottom will be 180 mm. Okay, now go to 3D model extrude, extrude it up to a height of 20 mm here change it to 20 ok and select this face go to create sketch go to circle command from same center point make a circle of dia 50 escape it is dragging so go to concentric Select this circle and select this circle. Now it is fully defined. Now go to 3D model, extrude, extrude this complete circle at 20 mm and OK. Now select this edge, go to fillet, take here a fillet of radius 15 mm and OK. OK. So this will be the handle. Now we have to make handle on this also. So go to uh, linear pattern or the rectangular pattern you can see. Select extrude 5, 4 and fill it 2. Go to direction 1. Click here for direction 1. The pattern will be at a distance of 325 mm. And the count of 2 and OK. So here also the handle is present. Now we will define the color. So the complete profile here will be of wood. So we are selecting from Autodesk appearance library. Here we will take from wild wood. Uh, wild. Okay. We are with wild wood. And we will take wild toast cherry wild to keep this this one wild cherry ambireto okay now the we have to change the handle colors select this rectangular pattern fill it extrude 5 and 4 from here we will take the color as chrome polished so in C we will find the chrome polished. So okay here chrome polished. Okay. So this will be the color of handle. Now this is the complete model. So this is a basic tutorial to how to construct a furniture model or a furniture cabinet in Autodesk Inventor. I hope you like the video. If you do that please do hit like and subscribe the channel. For more such videos, thank you.